Shalom, Yashrallah. All praises, all power, all glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakaha Kodash. Yahweh, be the name of the of the Father who the world every cause. God, Yahweh. Meaning he exists. Bahashem, meaning in the name. Yahweh Shai, who the world every cause, Jesus Christ. Yahweh Shai, meaning. He is salvation. Bahashem in the name. Kaha Kodash, Spirit Holy. Double honors to the apostles and elders, great most of the teacher and ruler who taught me this truth. Peace and salutation to the Akiyam, the fellow laborers, the hopeful elect, pushing this truth at risk of their own lives throughout the four corners of the earth. To the Aguathim, listen, listen, learning. Sincerity and truth and in silence, Shalom. Akiyam meaning brothers, Aguathim meaning sisters, Shalom meaning peace be unto you. It's your brother Shema from the GMS Toronto camp here in Toronto, here with another lesson, right? And uh, remember Lot's wife, right? Luke 17 and 32, remember Lot's wife. And these are the, wor the words of our Lord, Yahweh Shai, right? Because in this walk of ours, You're going to lose things. Right? One of the first things that happens to you when you come to this truth, speaking to myself first and foremost, you start to lose, you start to lose status, Esau status in the world, who you were in the world. Some of you may have been, some of, some of us may have been successful. Some of us may, may have been on a certain level of Esau's uh, ladder of success. Right? So you begin, to, you begin to lose things. And that's twofold. That's the Lord purging out their impurities out of us. Right? But it's also a sifting agent for those that are meant to come into this truth. Uh, endure for a while and then get sifted. As a matter of fact, scripture just came to mind. This is in the spirit. Was of Solomon four around the fourth verse? Was of Solomon four verse three? But the multiplying brood of the ungodly shall not thrive. All right, the multiplying brood of the ungodly shall not thrive. Scripture says there are more. Two thirds is, 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 is larger than one third. Nor take deep rooting from bastard slips, nor lay any fast foundation. Here's the point. For though they flourish in branches for a time, right? Coming to this truth, if it's your walk to come in and fall out, you're going to endure for a time. You're going to flourish for a time. Yet standing not last, but you're not going to last. They shall be shaken with the wind, right? The wind of what? False doctrine, right? Every wind of doctrine, right? And through the force of the winds, they shall be rooted out, right? And that's what's going to root them out of it uh, uh, ultimately, right? These, 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 Jebus, this, Jebus, that, do as thou wilt, right? That roots out those that are not. Those that came into the truth Salakia That roots out those that came into this truth Right? Back in uh, Luke 17 matter of, fact, let's read, matter of fact, let's read verse 5 The imperfect branches shall be broken off Their fruit unprofitable Not ripe to eat False teachers Right? And there's a lot of false teachers within the house of Israel, man. Right? Their fruit unprofitable. Right? They're going to teach. Right? Have men under them, but they're unprofitable. 
Yeah, meat for nothing, right? Empty. All right, let's go back into the subject matter. Remember Lot's wife. Luke 17 and 26. Red letter. And as it was in the days of Noe, Noe, Noah, so shall it be also in the days of the Son of Man. Right? And in the days of Noah, it was uh, like it is now. Right? Wicked. They did eat, they drank, they married wives. Right? And we see that going on out here. People living their lives, doing their thing. Right? They were given in marriage until the day that Noah entered into the ark. Right? Noah entered into the ark. Right? And the men of the Lord on the highways and byways and on the unicorn preaching this message, preaching the message of Yahweh Bashim Shai's return. Right? And the destruction, the missiles. Right? And the flood came and destroyed them all. And the missiles is going to come and destroy two-thirds of our people, along with, you see, the nation. Only the elect will be preserved. Right? Lord willing, we have that number. And Esau's nobles, elites. Likewise, also, as it was in the days of Lot, they did eat, they drank, they bought, they sold, they planted. They build it. But the same day that Lot went out of Sodom, it rained fire and brimstone from heaven and destroyed them all. Right? And the destruction is coming. Even thus shall it be in the day when the Son of Man is revealed, Yahweh Shai. In that day, he which shall be upon the housetop and his stuff in the house, let him not come down to take it away. And he that is in the field, let him likewise not return back. Remember Lot's wife, right? So you're going to lose things in this world, right? You may lose a job, employment, money, a woman. Your children may forsake you. Your comfortability, your, your, your security. Right? But there's no turning back. What is there to turn back to? Right? Coming in this truth and turning back. What is there? Let's get that. Let's close with that. There's nothing. It's a lot here. Pollutions. There's nothing to turn back to. Second Peter 2. Verse 20. For if they. Salakia. For if after they have escaped the pollutions of the world. Right? Through the knowledge of the Lord Yahweh Shai, Salaki, of the Lord Yahweh and Savior, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, right? You come to this truth, you receive this knowledge, right? You're escaping the pollutions of the world, the wickedness of the world, right? You become a new man, you become washed with the word, right? That old man is, 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 is slain, he's, 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 he's buried, that old man's gone. Right, who you were in the world, that's, that's behind you. You're no longer that guy, right? If you're in this truth, or claim to be in this truth, and you still have that old man in you, right? That, 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 that means the Lord still got to purify that from you, man. Or you're just going to get sifted. They are again entangled therein, right? You've gone back into the world, entangled with the cares of this life, this world. What it is you got going on. And overcome right look in this word overcome let's get it real quick con right this is overcome in the in, in the greek strong's g 2274 hey taomai hey taomai thayer's lexicon Hey Tao. Hey Tao. Right, to make less inferior, to overcome, to be made inferior, to overcome worsted, 
to be conquered by one, forced to yield to one. You see that? To be conquered by one, forced to yield to one. Right? This world, man. Right? You end up back in the world. And 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 you're, and you're conquered by it. You're 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 you're. You become subject to it, man. Right? Back in uh. Second Peter two and twenty four. For if after they have escaped the pollutions of the world, through the knowledge of the Lord and Savior Yahweh Shai Mashiach, they are again entangled therein, right in the world, and overcome, right. The latter end is worse with them than the beginning, right? You become worse off, man, right? And it's a fearful thing to fall into the, the, the power of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. It's scary, man, right? To fall out and end up back in the world, right? Bugged out, worse than, worse, a worse demon than you were when, when, you, when you were in the world, right? So that... Double honors to the apostles and elders, the great millstone, the teacher on Rubel. Shalom to the whole polite. Remember Lot's wife. Shalom.